Yo, yo, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Emperor Foss, I'm back with another NBA 2K16 video. And as you guys saw in the title today, we'll be discussing the best size ups in this 2K, NBA 2K16. Guaranteed to get you guys ankle breakers at the park. Because you know I would not have them equipped if they did not get angles. But first, before we get started, can you guys drop 25 likes on this YouTube video? It would mean so much to me. And thank you for your continued support. I cannot thank you enough. So now, let's jump right into the video. First thing you're gonna want to do is go to your signature styles, of course, and go to your size ups. The first one we'll be going over is the is size up inside out, which I have Jamal Crawford equipped it. This size up gets so many ankle breakers, I cannot begin to tell you how many I have gotten. You guys see in these clips behind me, it simply gets ankles no matter what the rep is of the player that is guarding you. I be dropping rookies to legend fours. I literally dropped a legend four with a Jamal Crawford move. I mean, of course, it's nothing to be surprised about, but still, you have to be rocking this Jamal Crawford move, and it helps you incorporate your other moves together if you know how to do it right. I have honestly been using this move since almost the beginning of 2K. Even before speed boosting was removed from this game, even when speed boosting was in the game, I always had this Jamal Crawford equipped it. I've gotten countless um, highlight plays, countless ankle breakers it does not matter you guys need to learn how to do this move appropriately and in the right situations of course you guys see me doing right here in the background i usually like to do this move right after i step back with the hesitation three if you guys want a video on how to do this step back the hesitation three in depth let me know and i'll do it for you I usually like to hit the Jamal Crawford after I do the Hesitation 3. I find that it gets so many ankles that way and you guys should try that out at the park. So overall for your ISO size up inside out, please equip Jamal Crawford and I guarantee you'll be finding a lot of ankles on the floor at the park. Now the next move we'll be going over is the ISO size up cross. The best size up cross in this year's 2K in my opinion is guard 1. There is a ton of good size up crosses this year of course. I think and I prefer guard one. I have so much experience with this move as you guys are going to see in the background in these clips. I can either use this move in a fast manner using a fast crossover left to right or right to left. I can let the move develop and let it actually play out and as you guys are going to see in this clip I used the Jamal Crawford and the ISO size up cross guard one in this clip right here size of my opponent and get the free easy basket if you have both of these equipped it just makes it so much deadlier and harder to guard you if you guys have these equipped that your opponent will not know if you're gonna cross over really fast using the guard one cross or you're gonna cr or you can actually just use the Jamal Crawford and break his ankles easily I would say a big reason why I get so many ankle breakers is because I get I have the killer crossover badge so make sure you have that badge extremely underrated in this year's 2k4 of the park and make sure you have it on gold it's very important as well so for recap the the best iso size up inside out is jamal crawford and the best iso size up cross is guard one go ahead and equip those both practice them and i guarantee you'll be getting ankle breakers at the park easy if you guys found this video helpful please leave a like let's try to get 25 likes on this video thank you for the continued support it has been your boy Epovasa, and i'll see you in the next one peace Hey!